Hi there, I'm Michael with eTrailer.com. Today we're going to take a quick look at the Timberin Axleless Trailer Suspension System. This suspension system is going to provide a nice, safe, smooth, quiet ride for your trailer. Uh, it does have two separate units that will replace your existing axle. It's going to fit your one axle and two axle trailers that use regular size tires. Uh, keep in mind it is not recommended for your triple axle applications. It does have a max weight capacity of 2,200 pounds. So again, make sure that your setup is going to work with that weight limit. Um, and if it is, I think these are gonna be a great option for you. The main springs here on the units are a Aon progressive rate spring, so they're going to help absorb road shock and support your trailer's load. They're gonna deliver a nice, smooth, stable ride, regardless of if you have a heavy load on your trailer or if there's no load at all. They're gonna still maintain that nice, stable ride. They are a 100% natural rubber uh, composition, so they're going to compress and become stiffer as the load increases, which is gonna help boost that spring strength. On the back side here, we've got a rebound spring. This is going to create constant pressure on the arm so that the suspension is never completely relaxed. That's gonna help act as a return device so that we're gonna have minimal rattle and bottoming out. So we're gonna have both springs working together there. Our arms are a nice heavy duty steel construction with a black powder coat finish. So they're gonna be very strong, resist wear and corrosion. And having the two units like this, it's going to uh, eliminate the need for a through axle. So that's going to have several different benefits. One, it's going to increase our ground clearance. So it's going to be great for your off-road uses. Uh, you can also use it to lower your deck height on your trailer. So that's going to be easier to load and unload. You're not going to have to have as sharp an angle on uh, your ramp to get up in or loading from the side could be much easier of if it's uh, lower to the ground. Also, uh, because they are independent, it's gonna help reduce the roll when you're turning corners and that sort of thing. And another benefit is that you're not gonna have any width restrictions uh, with your trailer. So you don't have to worry about the size of your axle anymore. As long as uh, these bolt to the side of your trailer, you're gonna be fine. So uh, very nice option there. They do have a built-in camber and tow-in to help your trailer to track straight, so that's gonna help reduce the wear on your tires. Here on the side, you can see we have a four inch lift easy lube spindle. Um, that's gonna be the same on both. That's gonna provide a great ground clearance with that four inch lift. Uh, the easy lube feature has the uh, Zerk fitting right here on the end, so we can easily add grease uh, without having to remove the hub, so that's gonna be nice there. This is going to uh, come without your hubs, so you will have to purchase those separately. It will accept your 1,750 pound trailer hubs. So keep that in mind, make sure that's gonna work for you as well. These spindles can be removed, so if something were to go wrong, if one was damaged, needed to be replaced, you can easily just remove that spindle and replace it, so you're not gonna have to worry about replacing the whole system. This is pretty easy to get installed and aligned. Uh, you basically just bolt or weld it onto your trailer frame. The attached hangers here are going to need three grade five half inch bolts for each one. So you're gonna need six total. So that does not come with the kit either. You will have to pick those up separately. Uh, so at least six of those grade five half inch bolts. Now, depending on your setup, you might need additional support. Uh, for your trailer. So if your trailer does not have a cross member above the spot where you want to install the timber system, you may need to reinforce the frame. So you can do that one of three ways. Either you can retrofit the trailer with a cross member, you can build out the trailer frame, or you can use a standard two inch steel tubing to uh, connect the two timber and suspensions together using the built-in square hole on each unit. So basically just pass that uh, two inch steel tubing through to connect them. Um, you can, that's again, not included, but you can find it at most weld shops. So uh, that is kind of recommended if you are replacing your axle. So that might uh, cut down a little bit on your ground clearance, but still that's sitting up pretty high. So you're probably still gonna get more ground clearance than you do uh, with your uh, current axle system. 
This does come with a three-year limited warranty from Timbrin. And I really do like this system a lot. I like um, the independent uh, action of them. I like the spring system. So uh, there, there are a lot of different benefits for these versus your leaf spring or your torsion axles. Um, just a lot less wear and tear, fewer components to go wrong on them. So I think these are going to be a great option if you've got a trailer that you often take off-road or you just want a much smoother ride even when you're on asphalt. I think this is going to be a great system for you. So that's going to complete our look for today. Again, I'm Michael with eTrailer.com. Thanks for watching.